What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to Mitchy Games here, and we are here with another episode of Pokemon Go. And so right now we are in lovely downtown Cedar Falls today here, and we're gonna be playing some Pokemon Go. Um, let's see where are we at. Where are we at? Where are we at? <laughs> okay, that's the blue. There's the blue gem, which is currently the library. Um, it's the GPS is like can be a little weird today. <laughs> I am trying to do three things at once, and it's very difficult. Uh, we'll see how we can do this here. Going, going, going. I think if I can do that. There we go, that's good enough. That'll work for now. So, this is the um, first stop we have today here is going to be the gym and right now it is blue so that is very good um, I am on Team Mystic if you can't tell by the shirt so um, right now let's see we got gold that has a level 3 gym here an Arcanine come on and a the king here That is what we got going on today here. Um, it's about halfway right now, so I'll leave it be. The GPS is kind of being glitchy today, so um, pardon on us if there is any issues going on with that, but we will keep going on and keep on um, playing today, as we all say in this world. <laughs> so um, I am from Cedar Falls, Iowa, if you guys do not know. Um, Please, on YouTube, do not find me because that's just kind of horrific. So, please. Um, actually, that's the thing I do want to address. Um, any YouTubers out there and stuff like that, please, 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 stay safe. Um, don't get in trouble with other YouTube stuff. Um, and let's see. Let's turn GPS off and on here again. The biggest problem I've been having lately with this game has been the uh, GPS. Um, this might it might be my phone actually, but you know, how's it going, man? Good. Um, but people playing Pokemon Go is kind of um, everyone's got their own kind of issues. Everyone's never had like really a good experience with the game. Uh, let's go ahead and get that Weedle, because we need that for evolution. Um, I'm currently a level 18, so I am trying to see. Uh, where we can go here? Oh, dang it! Come on. There we go. That works. Yeah. Got my first wheel of the day. Right, we'll go ahead and go down the street here. We'll skip the train station for now. Uh, the other one, guys, is like a little bit of a building marker. Um, can I give you a little bit of an story on about the game? Um, this was developed by Niantic, and um, they also did the Ingress game, so um, they have a lot of information that was already pre-built into this game from basically their previous game, Ingress. So there's a lot about that going on right now. Um, we'll see if we can keep going down the street here and get some more stuff here. Are we good again? All right, we're back. <laughs> There's another Poke Stop here, and this is a Single Speed Brewery. And this is kind of a local brewery for the area. Um, they started here, downtown Cedar Falls. Um, God, I can't remember when they actually started. Maybe I would say 2007, 8, somewhere around there. I could be wrong. I'm probably wrong. Um, but there is Single Speed. And um, they are now uh, taking over an old Wonder Bread factory, and they're going to turn it into a brewery slash beer garden. So that is exciting news for that area. Um, and that's over in Waterloo. So we go ahead and cross here. Not a lot of Pokemon players out this morning. Kind of interesting. And, uh, I might go after Pidgey. We'll see. Oh, we'll go after Pidgey. Why not? Okay. Let's see if we can get this Pidgey here, guys.
Alrighty here. I, I, I've heard the capture rates are actually pretty terrible right now. Um, Niantic even said in a Twitter comment that uh, they are having some issues with it. Um, Pokemon that should be running away aren't and aren't that should, so. And it's jumping. So, uh, for the folks out there who haven't played Pokemon Go me in a day or so, um, just be aware of that. Um, the capture rates are kind of bad right now. Um, not on purpose. Um, Niantic said there's a glitch in the system, so it's causing some issues with the game. So. All right. And we're just going to capture. I'll transfer it later for you guys because that's way too much work, way too much time, and just so much other stuff that's going on right now. Yeah, let's see. We got another Pokestop here. This one is all relative. Life is moving, growing, never changing. It's in our sculpture. Um, again, downtown Cedar Falls is known for their sculptures. So that's kind of awesome. Um, it really kind of gets people going time, talking about stuff here, too. Yeah, we'll just keep on going here. Oh, there's another Weedle. And we'll get the last stop here. And the last stop is the Cotton Theater. Now, a little bit about this building in particular. Um, it has been a kind of a play theater since... Sometimes the screen goes black. I like to do that. <laughs> I think I just saw one of my old co-workers. <laughs> that is always fun. But yeah, oh man, it is hot today. It's probably in the 80s, I would say at least. Let's go ahead and get these stops here, folks. And these, downtown Cedar Falls is kind of a good area if you just want to walk up and down and kind of get the stuff and kind of call it good. Um, All that kind of jazz and stuff like that. And it's been working pretty well, so. Oh, there's another Weedle. Always good to have Weedles. Let's see if we can catch this thing without it running away. Nice throw, we'll see if that counts. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. And it, it escaped. Um, some things I've noticed is there's been, there was a little confusion during the, the beginning of the game where um, People weren't quite sure what the circle meant. And actually, the tighter the circle is actually the better the catch rate. Um, curveballs also add to catch rate bonus as well, um, as well as the type of throw, if it's nice, good, or, or good, excellent, nice, um, kind of in that area. So it does depend how good you throw, um, if you throw a curveball, and so on and so forth. So um, that is very important to the game of Pokemon Go. So. Uh, let's see here. Trying to see if there's any Pokemon, or we're just gonna keep on walking. I think that's what we're gonna do. Um, I I got super lucky. I was kind of thinking about um, how I would do this as far as um, setting things up, and I have a voice recorder. I'll take care of the voice. Um, I got a recorder to take care of the uh, gameplay here, and then I have my iPod. <laughs> Working as my camera, folks, so. Um, jankiest setup in the world, but it does technically work, so. Um, we will go ahead and go with that, because that is awesome. And we're getting the sculptures again here on the way back. Oh, fun. I like it. <laughs> Pidgeot. Um, I might be interested in that. We will see. There's another Weedle. Definitely interested in those. Um, the reason why I'm catching a lot of wheels and that kind of stuff, that is the best way to, um, if you want to know how to, uh, level up, that's how you do it. You, uh, catch a bunch of Weedles, Caterpies, and Pidgeys. Um, they are the easiest to evolve, um, at 
Weedles and Caterpies are 12 piece and um, uh, there we go. Um, I believe Pidgeys are at 25, but um, Pidgeys are pretty plentiful, so that's why people are kind of saying get a Pidgey as well. So, oh my god, I have wasted like how many Pokeballs now on this guy? Um, <laughs> it is amazing. Bye -bye -bye. And there we go. And we have in our Weedle. Let's go ahead and we'll see, walk up to the next stop here. And someone dropped a lure, so let's see if we can find them maybe. That'd be fun. Um, I will do another episode on um, just in particular the Drowsy House. Um, if people don't know what that is, um, there is a building in Waterloo, Iowa um, called the Imaginarium. It's kind of like a science museum for kids. And um, mostly what it does is um, basically in short, it's just kind of an area for kids to kind of play around, kind of do some do sciencey stuff, that kind of deal. And it always basically has lures on it during the day, and it's always full of drowsy. It's like I got a friend who, <laughs> let's be honest, um, has probably close to. 10 hypnos and like 30 drowsies that that's what they that's what they're doing like that's what they have so um yeah it's kind of rat tats pidgey yeah, I might catch it we'll see yeah, it's out of the area now we'll just keep walking that yeah, works And we got the Weedle. Woo! Alrighty. Keep on going here. Oh, we got egg hatching. Alright, let's see what we got, folks. And a Ponyta! Which actually might be good, because I think I might have enough candy to evolve into a Rapidash. 20 candies, 44. Oh my god, I am six short. Six short of evolving into a Rapidash. Not bad, though. I'll go ahead and get this Pokestop as well. Every once in a while you get a really good one, and I've gotten some good items from them. Let's see. All right. Why am I too far away? <laughs> I uh, Let's see. Are we still in the gym? I want to see this now. No, we somehow lost the gym and got it back, so... But my Pokemon's not in it anymore, so we will have to go get, uh, battle it, put my Pokemon back in, and call it a day, so... Alrighty. Do we want to battle the gym again? Yeah, we'll give it a shot. Get his Prestige up. That might help. Actually, I think the Prestige went down, so I was checked. Uh, and my Sparky doesn't have enough energy. Yeah, we'll just go with Rainer. We'll be good. Alrighty, let's go. Oh, come on. It just does not like me today, because it's kicked me off before, so... Oh, wow, we, um... Lost the Pidgeot. And during one of the updates, um, Vaporeon got pretty nerfed. So, um, if you didn't know about that, during one of Niantic's updates, they did um, basically nerf um, Vaporeon. And we'll probably lose this, but it happens. We lose. But we did get the prestige up a bit, so we'll see where it's at now. Someone's trying to take it down, so 
I might just let him take it down and kind of ballot back up. See where all the Mystic players are today. Um, so a little bit of an update with Niantic here as well. Um, going on with uh, what they said recently about um, the tracking system, they took it down because basically they were having major issues with the tracking system. It was not working correctly, and it was actually what was causing a lot of their servers to drop. So basically Niantic says, we're working on a new tracking system. Um, it's going to be a while. Sorry, guys, but until then, just roll with it. Um, problem is, they also shut down like all third-party apps as well. Which, as uh, famous people have tweeted, um, you can't play Marco Polo and take out the polo part. You know, and you're just playing Marco. You don't know where the fuck you're going. So, and we are at the Cotton Theater again. These revives, like, I don't use them. <laughs> I've, I've, like, used a revive, like, a couple times, if that. And it's just been one of those things that um, hasn't been really handy or useful. So, keep on going here, folks. And we'll snipe the gym here. Let's see if we can snipe it. Come on. Can we get it? Can we get it? Can we get it? Yes. Ha! We sniped the gym. That is a troll of the day, folks. Troll of the day. We just sniped a gym that someone was taking down and put a blue Pokemon back in. <laughs> I, I, I love being a troll. I just love being a troll. It, it makes me happy today. So. Just gonna have some fun with that for a bit. I might see if I can cross the street. I see a couple of Pokemon players, so. And we always go and go. How's it going? Are you guys trying to take down the gym over there? Yeah. Yeah. Are you guys Valor or Instinct? Instinct? Yeah. Yeah. I'm doing some stuff for YouTube, obviously, so. Okay. Yeah. There's not a lot of Instinct players around. So, so, you mind if I interview you guys or can I talk to you? Sure. Okay. <laughs> These are the people. Hello. Hello. Hi. So, um, why did you guys choose Instinct? Uh, honestly, I thought that uh, because of the way that I dressed my character when I first created him and I put all yellow on that I had to choose Instinct. <laughs> <laughs> so, you basically chose on um, color, basically. At first, but I, I'm I'm happy with it now. So oh, that's cool. Staying out of drama between the other teams. <laughs> yeah, I feel like they're less hated than the other two teams. They kind of have that. Yeah, I, I've seen that too. Um. <laughs> hey, that yeah, that works. That works. And then you just kind of followed in with him. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Zapdos is, is the best. Awesome. Yeah. So that doesn't hurt. <laughs> so what do you guys think of the recent update with them taking the tracking system out, basically? Uh, I, I don't know. I've been like reading up on it, and I, they're working on fixing it. Hopefully, that's what the update that they just most recently posted said. So. Okay. Yeah. High hopes. High high hopes yeah. with Niantic. Yeah. You know. Trying to keep up with the the game, so when it does get fixed, hopefully, that I won't be like too far behind. Because I feel like some people are just gonna keep it. I mean, I've noticed with a couple players that um, they're already in like the 30s. I'm just yeah. going like. Uh, how much time do you guys have on your hand? Like, I'm 18, I have a full-time job, and I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I just hit 23, and that's, like, playing quite a bit. I don't know how people are 30, 30 plus. Yeah. It's crazy. Because especially after you hit, like, level 20, the levels just take, like, so long. For yeah. You to go up, so. Have you guys been anywhere else besides, like, downtown Main Street, kind of that area at all? Or? Yeah, we're from uh, Iowa City. We're just visiting for the weekend. So. Oh, so very nice, yeah. I go to the university down there. Oh, Okay. The downtown area there is just like this, but even crazier. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm I'm a cyclone, so sorry about that. Uh, but. Uh, that's okay. So. That's another reason I chose Instinct. Actually, it was just like the black and gold. Oh, okay, so you went with the Iowa oh, theme. So yeah, okay. I, I I can see where that goes there. Yeah, so. A few All right. Well, thank you guys for letting me talk to you a little bit here. Yeah. 
All right, well, this I think this will do it for today, folks. Um, just got one interview in with a couple uh, from Iowa City here. So, um, to shout out to you guys there. Um, thank you for stopping in wonderful Cedar Falls. Uh, hey. Um, and we will definitely have this video for you. So when you see it, be like, oh my God, we're actually popular. <laughs> uh, I am I am terrible with that stuff. Um, as always, guys, thank you for watching. Um, if you do like these videos and you want to see more of this type of video, um, please do give it a like. Um, I do appreciate them. I do watch them and kind of watch how that content gets done. So if you do like it, definitely let me know. If you do like my content and you want to see more great content, please do subscribe today, guys. Um, I do love my fans. I love my subscribers. Um, I've done one giveaway before. It was a dark red code. Um, end up having to give it to my third runner-up, so um, which is unfortunate. But that works. So as always, guys, keep on gaming, keep on having fun, and let's play. Woo woo Pokemon Go. Woo woo Pokemon Go. Woo woo.